Continuing coverage about sex trafficking, state agencies are working to bring online child exploitation to an end. Kenya Ross joins us now with details. Kenya? Jennifer, the Louisiana Attorney General's office said it had seen an almost 100% increase in child exploitation cases from 2022, and that's when they reached a record of number of a little under 11,000 cases. The cases increased from, from, excuse me, the cases increased from children spending a lot of time online. Louisiana investigative agencies are partnering with public and private organizations to support safe online practices for children. Child sexual exploitation online has become a global epidemic, along with the area of sex trafficking seeing higher numbers. One of the reasons it's growing is because traffickers is lucrative. Traffickers are preying on humans, on the lives of humans and individuals for profit. An international organization that's committed to preventing conditions that lead to online child exploitation acts says they support law enforcement agencies that are forward thinking in how they investigate child sexual abuse material. And that's something that we can improve in every single state uh, throughout our country is how not only are we detecting uh, child sexual, sexual abuse material on devices, but then how are we prosecuting it once we find it? Um, that's something that we really need to approve and holding big tech accountable um, for circulating CSAM material. The Department of Homeland Security launched its No to Protect campaign on Wednesday to combat online child exploitation with big tech companies and private sectors. With Homeland Security Investigations in New Orleans partnering with public and private sectors to join in on this campaign, they're making others aware that they can't afford not to understand child exploitation. If they're not educating themselves, then they're not aware of the dangers that are out there. So the more the public and parents and teens and children educate themselves, the more aware they will be of the dangers that are out there and how to prevent those dangers. On KNOE.com, I'll share tips from the campaign on how children can stay safe online. Jennifer.